Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So recently, Microsoft rolled out the latest Windows 11 Insider Canary Channel build, 25905. And um, I did post on that earlier today, and I'll leave a link to that video down below. Now, my reason for mentioning that build is because a, another new feature has been found that wasn't officially listed in the release notes for build 25905 and this was spotted by the Windows enthusiast Phantom of Earth over on Twitter. Now according to these findings it seems now that Microsoft is working on a new TPM troubleshooter option that will be part of uh, the Windows security app. Now currently in the stable version of Windows 11 version 22H2 if we head over to our Windows security app device security and we click on security processor. This is where we get information regarding the trusted platform module 2 um, chip, which is a system requirement for Windows 11, as many of you would know. Now, currently, if we click on this security processor troubleshooting, this is what the so-called troubleshooter looks like currently in the stable version of Windows 11 22H2, as mentioned. Uh, just below the error messages uh, at the top of the page, we get the clear TPM and they just give you a bit of a info and a bit of a warning regarding uh, what will happen if you clear the TPM. Now, if we head over to a screenshot provided by Phantom of Earth, here we can see the new TPM troubleshooter section right under that uh, error message at the top of the page, as mentioned. So this is the new part here. So currently in the stable version, we get this part at the top and we get this part at the bottom, according to this screenshot. And according to this screenshot now, the TPM troubleshooter find and fix problems with your TPM. And in this uh, example, it says no TPM vulnerabilities found. And then obviously to run the troubleshooter, you click on next and follow the steps to find and fix any issues you have with your trusted platform module. Now, just a quick recap regarding uh, TPM. Um, as mentioned, it stands for trusted platform module. And that's one of the Windows 11 system requirements um, to be able to run Windows 11. And I think uh, between the CPU and the TPM requirements um, to be able to run Windows 11 on older hardware, I think those have been the two uh, biggest challenges with a whole lot of users trying to upgrade from, as an example, Windows 10 to Windows 11, as we have been posting on over the last two years or so. So Microsoft now bringing a new TPM uh, troubleshooting feature now into that latest Canary build, and at this stage, it's very early days, so it's not known if this will roll out. That's currently in Canary build 25905, but just wanted to bring that to your attention uh, if you are following uh, new features that Microsoft is working on. And um, I don't know if it will really be of use. Um, I don't know really what will change with that new troubleshooter, but maybe it'll just be a add-on to the existing troubleshooters. And as mentioned, if you have any issues with your TPM chip, you can now run that troubleshooter, and that's in build. 25905 currently in the Canary channel. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.